action is the only catalyst addicts and alcoholics need to embark on their journey of recovery. Surfside Structured Sober Living is an extended care sober living for 18 to 34 year old men. We are strategically designed to provide young men the tools needed to rebuild, rediscover, and recover. Our comprehensive life development program utilizes three phases and measurable goals to provide a tangible way for residents and families to monitor progress being made. In addition, we implement 12-step immersion and daily adventure-based and action sport activities to expose residents to the joys of life. And, and I have to say, it's not like you're restricted, you know, trapped in a, in a dungeon. Like, you're, you're doing things. You're going to the beach. You're going to the gym. You're going camping. We must have gone camping three times in my first month and a half here. Along with activities, we have Camp Surfside, an 11-acre property that houses a year-round tent with a wood-burning stove, paintball field, and bonfire pit. Surfside is so much more than a sober house uh, or a program. With our daily activities, our supportive staff, our life development program, we're a place for guys to come and experience the fullness of life. You know, we deal with a lot of guys that experience the hopelessness from the amount of treatment centers they've been into, and we want them to know that this whole recovery thing is so much more than uh, sitting in group day in and day out, that uh, recovery is something to experience, that it's an actual opportunity. In our first phase, residents learn how to become sober men, build character, seek guidance, and ask for help. Before coming in the Surfside, side, I didn't know how to ask for help. I would always try to handle all of my problems by myself. And coming in, having not only the people who live there, but the staff who's gone through the similar situations than I have, I'm able to open up and ask for help and ask them how they resolved the issue or how they handled it. After the first phase is complete, residents will implement the tools they have learned and continue navigating life's challenges with honor and respect. Phase two prepares residents for their life after Surfside. Staff contributes knowledge from the professional world and employs life experience to teach residents how to manage life on life's terms. We teach that recovery is not a sprint, it is a marathon. Our third phase focuses on setting a strong, steady pace that will prevent burnout in the face of challenges. There are a few things that are guaranteed when someone goes through Surfside. One of these is that our residents get to experience the feeling of being content in their recovery. You know, by the time our guys transition out, uh, they have completed resumes, they've got jobs or back in school, uh, they've been through the 12-step process, they found legitimate hobbies, they've built a network of friends. After someone has come to us from a treatment center and completed our life development program, they on average have about six months of clean time, which in most circumstances is more clean time than they've ever had before. We monitor residents as they transition from daily structure to responsible men in society. By this time, our guys have a plan for financial independence and success after Surfside. Surfside not only taught me like recovery, but they taught me how to be a grown man. You know, from the smallest things of doing a household chore to as big as saving up money, enough money to live on my own. You know, starting literally from being homeless to transferring out and pretty much getting ready to move out and live on my own. In addition to our main sober living program, we have an optional fourth phase. Located blocks away from our main house, the phase four house continues to provide residents a soft, smooth transition back into the real world. While in phase four, residents continue working, attend college classes, and remain active members of the community. Surfside is a unique opportunity where the idea of recovery becomes a reality.